Hey guys, it's Willie Bean here, and welcome to my fourth episode of the Arsenal career mode on FIFA 14. As you can see, well, quickly saw, we are against Tottenham in the first match of this episode. This is going to be a great one, hopefully. As we see, Santi Cazorla, great fake shot. Let's it rip! Oh, so close! So close to get to the bottom corner, but Hugo Lloris was there. Jacki tried a little chip again. But Loris is there again. Now we've got a corner. He whips it in. Oh, Jekko. Jekko with the header. And that opens the scoring in the 19th minute. And that was 1-0. Brilliant header by Ed and Jekko. I accidentally skipped the replay, which ain't really clever. But, you know, what are you going to do? You can see Kabu. Ah, oh, Defoe's away, Defoe's away, and a tactical foul. I'm going to call that one a tactical foul by Radiski. <laughs> just a tactical, he didn't try to get the ball at all, it's just a tactical foul. Get everybody behind the ball. Here comes the free kick, and that's way wide. That is wide. Chesney boots it up. And there we go, guys. It's half time. I accidentally missed the goal from the foe, so I'm sorry about that, but he's one all. I couldn't remember the foe scoring, to be honest, so... <laughs> sorry about that, though, but as you see, we give away a penalty. And now the foe's going to take this. And the foe's hit the bar! The foe actually hit the bar. I'm so sorry about the um, missing the, the foe goal. I'll try and get that back for you. And then the Jekai. Ah, oh, Korea, no! No! I might be able to try and put the Defoe goal um, at the end of the episode, maybe, if I can. But uh, I didn't show you, but Vermaelen actually got injured in that match, so he's out, actually out for three months. And uh, he is transfer window now, transfer deadline day even. And I'm going to go to my shortlist because I have listed. Three centre backs that Arsenal's been linked to is Reed, Papadopoulos, and Cher or Shah. Now I've inquired for them all, so hopefully I'll hear something back. Hopefully. <laughs> you can see Suarez has gone from Liverpool to Barcelona. Hold on. Got emails. He wants 6 million for Cher. I ain't got 6 million, I've only got 4. <laughs> So, you know what, I, I was a little stupid, because I, I played around with it a little, I offered four, three million, with, <laughs> you ain't gonna believe this, but Boateng, the shit 58 rated centre back, I, I, I knew there wasn't gonna be any chance in that, but you never know, I thought I'd give it a go, 14 million for Pavdopoulos, that's too much, they're not interested in Reed joining my team, but I'm still going to have a little go anyway. I offered 2 million because his value is only 2.2. .2. So I thought maybe 2 million, try and persuade him a little maybe. Not sure. Well, she bought him right. Rooney has gone to Real Madrid. And Benzema has actually gone to uh, Borussia Dortmund. So that's a little, little weird. I mean, Suarez... All, all my career modes, Suarez always seems to be the one who moves. And actually Rooney as well. Rooney and Suarez is one of the ones who move. I also get Lewandowski as well who keeps moving. And Thiago Silva. So, <laughs> maybe you never know. That might actually happen. We've got a couple more emails back. Transport offer for Matasaka. He's back from injury now. But I'm still going to reject it anyway. Because I still need him. He is still a quality centre back. And I, if the player is too valuable to West Ham. So I'm still going to go for it, you know. Still going to go for it. I need a backup centre back. I'll put 3.3 and, and see what they say because I, I need him, you know. No doubt in it, especially when. Um, Vermaelen's injured now as well. I mean, I know we've got Matasaka back, but we've got, we've got no backup, except from Boateng. And it's unacceptable 
They're not interested in the player, and the cash sum is not enough. But I ain't really got the funds to do it. So I kind of got carried away. I thought I had more, but I only have 4 million. So I thought, ah, go on. 4 million plus Boatang. <laughs> Don't think it's going to go down well, but you never know. You never know with FIFA. So the last three hours of the transfer window on deadline day. Still nothing back from West Ham for Reed. Is it going to look likely? Still nothing back. A little Aguero. Bayern Munich wants Aguero and we have an email back. They have accepted but I think it's too late because it's only in the last hour so I'm not going to mess around with this. I'm going to offer the 40,000 a week that he wants and the three years and a crucial first team player. I don't think it's going to be enough. I think it's a bit too late now. I only got the last hour which I don't think can actually get anybody in the last hour and no, I think I think I checked back and that email was um about the deadline day, about the deadline day finished. Man United still Oh my god, they actually got Thiago Silva. Manchester United got Thiago Silva. And guys we're in the Capital One Cup now against Bolton. This should be an easy game, but you never know, it's your quick seam lineup. You never know with football. Bolton can easily win. Here we go, guys. Kick off now. And Wilshere. Come on, ref. That was a penalty. That should have been a penalty, surely. I thought that was a penalty. But obviously not. It's his FIFA. Ozil. Ozil on the break. Brilliant through ball to Dzeko. Dzeko's going to take a shot. And it's in. It's a goal. Yes. 1 0, guys. In the 36th minute. It took a little time, but at least we got the goal. At least we got the first goal. That was a beautiful ball by Ozil. Just oh, a lovely strike. I'm so happy about Jekko now. Raw caught through the middle. Ah, oh, brilliant save. Sorry that, that that game was a bit too short. Nothing really much. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, please give it a like rating. Please share it and please subscribe. And... Thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next video.